वाहे गुरु 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 वाहे वाहे गुरु सुत्या गुरु सालाही है उठद्या पी गुर आलाओ कोई ऐसा गुरमुख जे मिले हो ताके तोवा पाओ कोई ऐसा सजन लोड है मैं प्रीतम दे मिलाए सतगुर मिलिए हर पाया मिलिया सहज सुभाए मिलिया सहज सुभाए ਤਾਂ ਤਾਂ ਗੁਰੂ ਗ੍ਰੰਥ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਜੀ ਦੇ ਹਾਜ਼ਰ ਸਾਜੀ ਨਿਵਾਜੀ ਗੁਰੂ ਪੈਸਾ ਸਿੰਘ ਰਾਮ ਨੂੰ ਕੀ ਫਤਿਹ ਬਾਣੀ ਜੀ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕਾ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕੀ ਫਤਿਹ ਵੈ ਵੈਰੀ ਬਲੈਸਡ ਦੈਟ ਵੀ ਹੈਵ ਗੋਟ ਥਰੂ ਅਨ ਅਨਸਾਈਬ ਸੈਵਨ ਬੋਡੀਜ਼ ਨਾਉ ਵੀ ਵਾਂਟ ਟੂ ਦੀ ਏਥ ਬੋਡੀ ਆਫ ਅਨ ਅਨਸਾਈਬ ਨਾਉ ਵੀ ਸੀ ਇਸ ਦ ਫੁੱਲ ਅਨ ਅਨਸਾਈਬ ਨਾਟ ਵਾਟ ਵੀ ਰੀਡ ਇਨ ਦੈਟ ਅਨਸਾਈਬ ਬਟ ਵੀ ਸ਼ੁੱਡ ਰੀਡ ਇਨ ਦ ਮਾਰਨਿੰਗ 40 ਬੋਡੀਜ਼ ਸੋ ਲਾਸਟ ਵੀਕ ਵੀ ਲੁਕਡ ਐਟ ਦਿਸ ਬੋਡੀ ਦ ਸੈਵਨਥ ਵਨ ਵਿਚ ਮਾਰਸ ਫਿਨਿਸ਼ਿਸ ਆਫ ਬਾਈ ਸੇਇੰਗ ਕਹ ਨਾਨਕ ਇਹੋ ਆਨੰਦ ਹੈ ਆਨੰਦ ਗੁਰ ਤੇ ਜਾਣਿਆ ਤਾਂ ਥਿਸ ਇਜ਼ ਦੀ ਆਨੰਦ ਵਾਟ ਵਾਸ ਦਾ ਆਨੰਦ ਸਦਾ ਆਨੰਦ ਆਨੰਦ ਸਦਾ ਆਲਵੇਸ ਟੂ ਬੀ ਇਨ ਬਲਿਸ ਐਂਡ ਵਾਟ ਡਿਡ ਦੇ ਸੇ ਇਨ ਦਾ ਬੋਡੀ ਦੇ ਸੇ ਦਾ ਵਿਦ ਥਿਸ ਆਨੰਦ ਸਾਡੇ ਕਿਲਵੇ ਕੱਟੇ ਜਾਂਦੇ ਹੈਗੇ ਆ ਦਾ ਆਵਰ ਸਿੰਸ ਆਰ ਕਟ ਅਵੇ ਵੀ ਫੀਲ ਦਾ ਬਲਿਸ ਆਫ ਵਾਈ ਗੁਰੂ ਵੀ ਕਨੈਕਟ ਟੂ ਥੈਮ ਨਾ ਕਨੈਕਸ਼ਨ ਸਟਾਰਟਸ ਟੂ ਪਿਊਰੀਫਾਈ ਅਸ because they are pure so when we connect to them we become pure aisa naam niranjan hui niranjan means to pure naam is purifying and mara says ki gyan anjan is also something we get in that body gyan anjan means the the surma anjan of gyan so on our eyes we start to get wisdom so when we look at the world we look at it through the lens of guru's wisdom and not through what we previously thought and then mara says ki moh tutta as we get that gyan we start to break our attachment with family and with other friends and the things in the world that we value so much a lot of the time we value things in this world a bit too much and don't value wahiguru enough so moh tutta and then what is the effect of all of this ki sada sabad sache savariya the our speech becomes savar must becomes beautiful and it also gets sorted up now becomes powerful not only does our bachan the bachan of the such person who gets to this level like in saram khand it becomes beautiful but in karam khand it becomes powerful saram khand ki bani roop and then karam khand ki bani jor the speech of this person the bachan that they give becomes both roop beautiful and jor powerful The question that comes up in many six mind there is Maharaj who gets this anand who is able to get such anand and where can we go to get this anand so Maharaj starts the next body of by saying baba jis tu deh soi jan paave baba now baba has many meanings in those days a lot of people use it for their father mera baba baba or wahe guru you are like my father jis tu deh soi jan paave before guru maharaj has started to speak to their mother ke anand paya meri mai sat guru mein paya na they speak to their father wahe guru they say oh baba that person whom you give this anand to is talking about jis tu deh token about that bliss this is this what we just talked about those that you give it to they will get it soi jan paave jis tu deh who you give it to soi jan only those people get it now it's interesting because they use this word jan they could have said nar they could have said manuk but the word maharaj uses jan jan can mean human being but another meaning of the word jan is to be a servant you know a das so maharaj saying those people who you give it to you could look at it in two ways the servants get this your chele his servant means chela always and not just the person who says i'm your servant but your asal chela hove so 
just to the, those servants of yours, they get this. Or you can look at it the other way and say, Maharaj, those people that you bless with this anand, with this situation, they become your servants. Because obviously, it's a two-way situation. When you look at the mountain, you look how big it is, you feel small. When we, ex when we see why we experience them, suddenly we get the truth about how little we are, how insignificant we are, and how great and amazing they are. Jis tu dehe soi jana pave. That person gets this anand, that person gets this gyan, the wisdom, the naam, and their moho breaks and their sin breaks. Mara says, Pave ta so jana dehe jis no hor kya karhe vecharya. Pave ta so jana. Those people definitely receive it. On the kokai varina had the demak which shanka yan dehega. We get a bit of a doubt. We start thinking, but is it true that by following our Guru, we will get this bliss? When people start talking about Dasan Dwar, they start talking about Anand of connected to Vaya Guru, because not many people are talking about it in our families, not many people are talking about it on TV, it's not written down in most of our books. We might start to doubt whether it's possible to get this bliss, whether we can achieve that connection to Vaya Guru. So Mara says, Pave ta so jana dehe jishnu. They definitely will get this bliss, those ones that you bless, those ones that you give it to, because this is your power, Vai Guru. So our, our aim is to become a servant of our Guru and then live to earn our Guru's grace. And then Mala says, Hor kya kare vicharya. Hear the word vicharya, it doesn't mean vicharna, ve, it's a, it's a love on the Baba, and it means vichari, the sad people. Those people that have no power, you can say somebody's bichara. Those people that don't get this, what will they do? Hor kya kare vichari. If you don't get the bliss, what can you do to Vaiguru? Can you write a letter of complaint? Huh? Can you do a protest? Ajkal, if we don't get something that we want, we start thinking, let's write letters of complaint. We'll say, let's, send a, let's have a jatha, go and do some protest outside. Where will we go to complain to Vaiguru? That you didn't give me this anand. Hor kya kare vichari. Ki karoge? Nothing. There's no one to complain to because he's the one in charge. Even in our families, many families like my family as well. I'm into Sikhi. A lot of my family isn't. How did this happen? Was it because I was something special? No. Because Maharaj did kirpa. Those people that are blessed, they get pulled in. They get pulled into his sharan. The people that are here right now in the Gurdwara, they could have, they must, nearly everybody here must have two or three things they could go to right now. But they chose to come to Gurdwara to learn about Guru Amar Das's Bani. In the same way, the people that are into Sikhi don't think Ki Evara, this guy is amazing, think he Maharaj has decided to bring him into Sikhi. And the people outside, they were also led astray by Vaheguru as well. Even in the same family, there's the two people doing part. One person would be experiencing the Bani, the other person won't be experiencing the Bani. Huh? Why is that happening? Many times we start getting proud that we are experiencing the Bani. Maharaj is telling us, don't be proud of what your achievements are. Because they're not your achievements, they're your blessings. Yeah? So you have to be thankful. So this Pankti has so many different meanings. One of the things it definitely gives those people that are upon the path is to say, Ki Maharaj, it's all your kirpa. You've, you've blessed me, that's why I'm here. Otherwise, I'd be outside doing all sorts of gandigam. Maharaj kirpa, I'm here, we're in the Gurdwara listening to Bani. Paveta so jana dehe jishnu. Those you give it to, they definitely get this. Hor kya kare vijariya. The people that don't get this, what can they do? They can't complain to you. And in fact, only Virle Ke Ike, very few people Virle Ke Ike means, only very few people get this extreme bliss of just Sada Anand, continuous bliss. And they, again, Maharaj is speaking to them as well, that those people, they are blessed as well, and they should thank Vaheguru. Even if we can't demand it of him, we can't even buy it of him. And they call, if you don't give somebody something, 
they say, Chalo, I'll protest, I'll complain. Then they say, Chalo, how much does it cost then? I'll give you what you want for it. You see, you can't even buy it off Y Guru. You can't go up to him and say, Chalo, I've got extra, I'll give you a million pounds, give me now. You can't buy it off him, you can't threaten him. He is near Po, he is near Van. All we have to do to get it is Mara is going to describe to us next what we're going to have to do to get it. Then Mara says, Ek param pule phere deh dis Ek naam laag savariya Mara says ek Now when Mara does this ek It doesn't mean one It means some This is sihari bhi hai There's not an onkar and the kanka There is a sihari So this means some people Ek param pule deh phere deh dis Some people are lost pule Lost in param. What is param? In illusion or doubt. And they call, you could go to your friends in your, in your school, you can tell them, there is something called bliss. You've got the sandwar. You can connect to Y group. And they call, Loki has You can go tell your friends at school, even your gore, tell them there's this thing here, you can experience bliss, come to Gurdwara, and you can achieve it. And they will look at you like you're mad. Vesit to see, bilko sach bol rahe you. It's Aad Sache, Jugad Sache, Happy Sache, Nana Khosi Pisha. You are speaking the truth upon the truth, but the world will think this Ma is crazy, or this lady is crazy. So why? Ek Param Pule. They are lost in their doubt. They doubt Gurbani, they don't believe it's true. Can they know Maharaj is talking like this? Nay, nay. Eh Sache, Sachi Bani. Ek Param Pule. Then what happens to them because they lost? Pire Deh this. Pire means to wonder, Deh this means, Deh means uh, directions, and Disha, sorry, ten, Deh means ten, and this means Disha, which is directions. So they wander in the ten directions, which basically means they wander everywhere. They haven't got a place to rest, because they're always wandering from one thing to the next thing to the next thing. Even if you look in the world, many people go through phases, sometimes they, they follow Buddhism for a little while, then they follow a little bit of uh, modern age, they'll follow a bit of this, follow a bit of that. But they don't come to rest somewhere to realize what is a true way. They might go into money, might go into alcohol. They wander from here to there to there to there. If that's what Mara says, Pire Dehdis. They wander around because they haven't found the truth. And what is the truth? Some people, Ek Naam Lag Savariya. Some people are blessed. Because Baba. The Vaheguru, our father, he's given it to them. What happens to them? Naam Lag Savariya. They get attached to the Naam. Lagge Hagi. They're attached to the Naam. So Naam is something could be attached to us inside us. Kapribi Lagi and Al Hana. Andar and Bahar. We're attached to Naam. And then because of this, Savarge. Savar can mean ki beautiful. And effectively, what Maharaj is saying here is that because the Naam is attached to them, that their whole jivan, their whole life becomes beautiful. Naam Lag Savariya. Because that's what Naam does. The connection to Vaheguru, it makes your whole life beautiful. Because we've come here for this, isn't it? I see, 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 I that Pai Parapat Manuk De Huriya Gobind Milan Ki Ehe Teri Bariya Avar Kaj Tere Kite Na Kaam they told us, you've come here as a human being, your main purpose is to connect to Vaheguru. So when they get this, they have achieved their main purpose. That's it, they've done it. That's the main thing they came here to do, they've achieved it. Ekanam Lag Savariya. They're not wandering around in lost, lost in doubt. Mara says in Vain, Dubda Dur Karo, live life. Get your doubt, Dubita can be doubt as well. Get your doubt far away from you and get attached to Vaheguru with love. With love. The Maharaj carries on, they say, Gur parasadi man paya nirmal jinna paana paave Gur parasadi By the Guru's grace, what happens? Man paya nirmal Our mind, man paya means becomes Nirmal. Nirmal. Mal is dirt. Nir is the op- without. So without dirt, our mind becomes purified, becomes pure. But the Guru's grace, 
our mind becomes pure. To whom? Jinna Pana Pavi. Not everybody gets their mind beautiful by Guru's grace. Only those people, Jinna Pana Pavi. Pana means Vaiguru's Hukam, their order. Pave means that you start to like the hukum. You actually love Vaiguru's Hukam. The Hukam is going to happen anyway. Huh? Maharaj could have said, you know, Pana, and then Manage, in a way. Mara says, no, take it further. The person who doesn't just accept the hukum is going to happen because we can't change the hukum anyway. Hukum andar savako, bar hukum na koi. But this time, these, these people, they start to love the hukum. Because they say, Baba, jis tu de soi jan pave. You could apply this to everything. You could say, ki, those who you give money to, you've given it to them. Those you don't give it to, they haven't got money. You could apply it to wealth. You could apply it to looks, you could apply it to studies, education, family, everything. If you start to say this, he Maharaj, whatever I haven't got, doesn't matter. What I've got, you've given it to me. You start to be happy in his hukum, then you become those people, jinna, pana, pave. You start to become thankful. You look around, you say, why Guru, I'm so happy, I'm so lucky, I'm sitting here in a Gurdwara right now. The world could be lost. I could be outside wondering, lost in doubt, but I'm here and I'm thinking about your name. Doesn't matter what's happened to me, doesn't matter what's going on in my life, but right now, I'm on the right path. And thank you so much for bringing me here and putting me on the right path. Bhule Marg Jine Bataya, Esa Guru Vadpa Gipaya. His place is upon the path that we'd forgotten, and we are so lucky to have such a Guru. So this person starts to become happy in Vaheguru's hukum. Jinna pana pave. They say things that tera kiya mitha lage har naam padharit nanak mange. They understand Maharaj, all I got to do is love your hukum. Your will is sweet to me and then I only have one benti. Because you can't demand it of him, we're going to have to beg it of him. Har naam padharit nanak mange. This is the thing that we should come here and ask for. Ki Maharaj, make me love your hukam and then make me, and then please bless me with your naam. Jinna pana pave. Now one meaning of this also obviously is that this person becomes happy with what they have but also whatever is going to happen they start to lose their desires about what's going to happen next. Because obviously if you have more desires you get disappointment. The more desires you have they don't get fulfilled, they don't get, and then you get unhappiness. So this person starts to lose their desires as well, and that is part of becoming nirmal. Because Guru Prasadi Manapaya Nirmal. Jene bhi asa hondi hai, kaamna hondi hai ghi hai, or fir maili hondi hai ghi hai. So they become nirmal, they start to lose their desires, they start to be happy what they have, they start to lose the desire for more pride and more respect, that's ahankar. Pride for more calm, lust, for, uh, uh, desires for more calm, then they start to lose their desire to change the world around them, so they don't become as angry as well. They start to say, accept it. Then lob, lob is all about greed, that's one big dirt that we have, they start to lose that. As these things happen to them, they start to lose their desires, their mind becomes shant. When they start to understand that it's calm, just relax, don't worry, you got everything you need, right here, then they become more and more purified, because just like that water in the wave that we talked about, if you've got a lake and it's full of waves, it's not shant. But the whole idea is to calm it down, and desires are one big way to remove all those waves, and just have a nice peaceful mind. So, Guru Parasadi, Man Paya Nirmal, Jinna Pana Pave, they become pure. The Maharaj says, Kya hai nanak jis deh pyare soi jan pave. Kya hai nanak. Guru Amar Dasi Maharaj says, I am nanak. They say, Tusi sohas deo mein Guru Amar Dasi ga? But nahi. They say, I am nanak. Because you know we're going through this now. This is after Japji Sahib, the first part written where Guru Amar Dasi is saying, Nanak, kya hai nanak. They say, listen, don't get confused, I am Nanak. Kya hai Nanak? Jis dehe pyare. The person who gets given this gift, this gift of Anand, 
And now, the second part of this gift, which has been explained to us, the person who gets given the gift of being happy in God's will. Those people that get blessed with this Pana Mitha and with the Anand, then and the Naam, they get attached to Naam, Soi Jan Pave. Only that person gets given with this. Now the Pyare here can refer to Wahiguru. O Pyare. Jis Deh Pyare. O Pyare, who you give it to, O Wahiguru. But also, Guru Sahib is talking to us as well. Say, O Pyare Guru Sikha, E Yad Rakhi, Jinu Odenda Haga, Onuhi Milda Haga. To hankar na kari. Say, oh, oh Guru Sikh, remember this. If you've been given with anything, if you've been blessed by him, then don't start walking around toward Nal. Look at me, I'm so, I'm so lucky I got Nam. No. Just say thank you. Thank you so much for what you've given to us. So, now the thing is though, after this, people get confused. They say, hold on, if he's giving it to me, so what did I do? What have I done? They get confused now. People will say, well, is there free will or is there not free will? Look, you know, part of this is because they don't quite get what they sh- They know what they should do, but they want to understand the system first before they get it. For me, it's a bit like someone gives you an iPhone, shows you how it works. Everything they explain to you, you go, that's great. But then, before you start to use the iPhone, you go, but hold on, show me the code. How does it work? Not just show me the code, open it up and show me how the things talk to each other. You will say, ki fada? Most people will say, look, I haven't got long enough in my life, I haven't got enough sense to understand how the machine itself works, how the software itself works. All I know is, it works, and I know what I should do with it. We don't need to go and go to China, to the factory to work out how it works. Now some of these questions we have about free will, they're a bit like this. As if we're actually going to fly to China to work out how the fact and how the iPhone works. We're never going to do it. But people still want to ask the question. They know what they should do. Mahal is now going to explain in the next body what we should do to get this. But even if we do ask, then last time Guru Ram Dashi Maharaj gave in a hukam, they say, Gur Sikhmeet, Chalo Gur Chali. Jo Guru Kahe, Soi Pal Man Ho, Har Har Katha Nirali. Guru Amdashi Maharaj says, O oh, friends of mine, O oh, Guru Sikh friends of mine, Guru Sikh Meet, walk upon the Guru's path, Chalo Guru Chali. Don't get into too much of these mental questions about what should I do, what should I do. Is it possible for me to do anything? Should I just lie in bed all day long? You know tomorrow morning you're going to get up and make your breakfast anyway. You might as just listen to what Maharaj is telling you. Jo Guru Kehe, what Maharaj says, Soi Pal Manaho. Accept that is good. And then, Har Har Katha Nirali. The talk about Naam, Har Har here means Naam. It's repetition, na? Naam. Har Har Katha Nirali. This way is very unique. It's not easy to find it. And also, it's very hard to explain it to somebody. Ek Karan Wala Kam Hai Chalo Guru Chali. They say Suno. They didn't say Manno. They say Chalo. Do it. Wake up in the morning, say Waheguru. In the night time before you go to sleep, say Waheguru. In the morning I'll carry on saying Waheguru. The first thing we read in the morning, the f- first thing we read before we started, is ki sutya gur salahiye, utdya pi gur alao. At night time, say Waheguru, tan guru. And then in the morning wake up and say tan guru, Waheguru. Yeah? Dono karo, play praise our guru, say Waheguru's name. Because we're so lucky to have this path given to us. So what we're going to do now is that we're going to sing this Shabad. Yeah? We know our Guru's told us, Pai Gurdash has told us, that Charan Saran Gur Ek Panda Jaye Chal, Sadgur Kot Panda Aage Hoye Let Hai. Be assured, if you take one step towards your Guru, Guru will take thousands and thousands towards us. Ham Andale And, Dikhe Bikharate, Kyo Chalhe Gur Chali. Sir, how am I a blind person? absorbed in poison, how can this blind person who is attached to poison actually walk upon the Guru's path? Give it chaliye. Then what is, he, what is the answer? Because Bani is a conversation. Maharaj gives the answer. He says, Satgur daya kare sukh data ham lave apan pali. If Guru Sahib, the Satguru, who is a giver, the giver of peace, 
If he does kirpa upon us, then he attaches us to his robe. All we got to do is ask for it. Sadaqa mahega mangana. Maharaj kirpa karo, attach me to your robe. Maharaj got a nice chola on. Imagine Hanasi Karnana Simon. Imagine Guru Hargobind Sahib Maharaj is walking and they got this big robe with 52 kaliya. Yeah, All you got to do is Maharaj, please give me one of those. Kirpa karo Maharaj, just ek minu fraadu. Yeah, that is a sixth job. Sikh ne inna kaam karna hai ki Maharaj minu ek fraadu. And then all the Sikh has to is hold on tight. Guru Sahib's job is to give us everything else. Baba, jis tu de soi jan paave. They bless us, we will get this. So then, Maharaj says, the next body, Aavo Sant Pyaare Ho, Akat Ki Kare Kahani. Say, Oh Saints, Aavo. Aavo is all about meeting together. Aavo 
ਸੰਤ ਪਿਆਰੇ ਹੋ ਓ ਬਿਲਵਿਡ ਓ ਬਿਲਵਿਡ ਸੰਤ ਉਹ ਸੰਤ ਕਿੱਥੇ ਤੇ ਸੰਗਤ ਦੀ ਗੱਲ ਹੋ ਰਹੀ ਹੈਗੀ ਹੈ ਸੰਤ ਸਭਾ ਮਾਰ ਇਸ ਤੋਂ ਕਿ ਨਬਾਤ ਦ ਸੀਕਸ ਓ ਸਪਿਰਚੁਅਲ ਪੀਪਲ ਦਾ ਵਾਂਟ ਟੂ ਵਰਕ ਅਪਨ ਇਸ ਪਾਥ ਕਮ ਟੂਗੇਦਰ ਇਕੱਠੇ ਹੋਵੋ ਬਿਕਾਜ਼ ਇਨ ਕਲ ਜੂ ਦ ਪੀਪਲ ਦੈਟ ਡੂ ਮਾਰੇ ਕਮ ਉਹ ਵੀ ਇਕੱਠੇ ਹੁੰਦੇ ਹੈਗੇ ਓ ਦ ਪੀਪਲ ਦਾ ਵਾਂਟ ਟੂ ਰੋਂਗ ਥਿੰਗਸ ਦੇ ਗੈਟ ਟੂਗੇਦਰ ਦੇ ਗੋਟ ਦੇ ਜਥਾਸ ਦੇ ਗੋਟ ਦੇ ਬਿਗ ਮੀਟਿੰਗਸ ਦੇ ਗੋਟ ਦੇ ਯੂ نو ਅਦਰ ਸਟਫ ਸੋ ਮਾਰ ਇਸ ਹੋਨ ਸੰਤ ਵੀ ਇਕੱਠੇ ਹੋਣ ਲੈਟ ਦ ਸੈਂਸ ਗੈਟ ਟੂਗੇਦਰ ਇਸ ਵਾ ਆਵੋ ਸੰਤ ਪਿਆਰੇ ਹੋ then what should we do akath ki kare kahani akath dekho kahani means a story and normally a story is something that often has a parable behind it like last we talked about the monkey hai na so there's always some kind of story which gives you the ishara the kind of points you in the right direction has a teaching behind it which points you mara says akath ki kare kahani katha means to describe something and then akath means that you can't do katha of it because you can't fully describe it so only why guru is akath whenever one says akath they say why guru you can't describe it fully and we can't sit here and say katha hogi why guru ni we haven't done finish the katha of why guru no wherever we finish we'll always say we just started as a shuru hai ye gal because maharaj has told us that he's akath maharaj is aavo sant pyare ho akath ki kare kahani let us join together and let us talk about wahe guru do kahani anyway tell stories about him talk about him but realize that he is akath we can't finish the story of anyway so you know what when maharaj told it so many years ago 400 years ago sikhs have been doing katha of wahe guru for the last 400 years and we said i'm finished otherwise we said it hogi katha it's finished 400 years ago mara said it we done it 400 years job done nahi 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 hale tak nahi hui yeah akath ki kare kahani whatever maharaj is said this to even 2000 years 5000 years from the now kripa kare the pant is chadi ka even then ehi gal manni hai ki ki we got to get together we got to talk about why guru many times in shabad maharaj told us in the quick ho shabad ka आवो संत मिलो मेरे भाई मिल हर हर कथा करो मारे से ओ सेंट्स ओ माय ब्रदर्स आओ इकट्ठे होवो मीट टुगेदर मिल व्हाट शुड वी डू हर हर कथा करो टॉक अबाउट नाम हर हर मींस नाम नाम ऑफ वाहे गुरु डू कथा ऑफ नाम इट्स वेरी नाइस शब्द बा गुरु रामदास जी दाओ अनदर वन गुरु नानक देव जी मारे से आवो पहने गल मिले है अंक सहे लड़िया मिलके करे कहानिया समृद्ध कंत किया हां कैसे ओ ना देख एवरीबॉडी सिंग भाई यू माइट थिंक व्हाई आर यू टॉकिंग टू मेन बट गुरु नानक जी महाराज ना टॉक्स टू द वुमेन दे गो ओ माय सिस्टर्स ओ माय फ्रेंड्स कम टुगेदर आवो पहने माय सिस्टर्स मिले है गल मिले है मी मी हग मी सिस्टर ऑफ्टन वुमेन व्हेन दे मी इच अदर हग मोर देन मेन एनीवे ਹਾਂ ਬੰਦੇ ਤੇ ਸ਼ੇਕ ਹੈਂਸ ਇਨ ਦਾ ਮਾਰਾ ਸੇਸ ਫਰ ਦਾ ਫੈਮਿਲੀ ਸਾਡੇ ਕੋ ਆਵੋ ਹੋ ਆਵੋ ਹੋ ਪਹਿਨੇ ਗਲ ਮਿਲੇ ਹੈ ਅੰਕ ਸਹੇਲੀਆਂ ਮਾਇ ਕਲੋਸ ਬਿਲਵਿਡ ਸਹੇਲੀਆਂ ਫਰੈਂਡ ਸਿਸਟਰਸ ਮਿਲ ਕੇ ਕਰੇ ਕਹਾਣੀਆਂ ਸਮਰਤ ਕੰਤ ਕੀਆਂ ਲੈਟਸ ਮੀਟ ਟੁਗੇਦਰ ਲੈਟਸ ਡੂ ਕਹਾਣੀ ਟੋਕ ਅਬਾਊਟ ਹੂ ਦ ਕੰਤ ਦ ਵਾਹੇ ਗੁਰੂ ਦ ਹਸਬੰਡ ਲੋਰਡ ਹੂ ਇਜ਼ ਸਮਰਤ ਮੋਸਟ ਪਾਵਰਫੁਲ ਲੋਰਡ ਆਫ ਆਲ ਆਫ ਆਵਰਸ ਵਾਹੇ ਗੁਰੂ ਬਿਕਾਜ਼ ਯੂ نو ਵਾ in the world if you find something really important like a jewel na you don't share it eh hey, here na let's say you found a gold treasure in your backyard you ain't going to start going now look for i you ain't going to shout it out you're going to go in you're going to go quite etra and tell your wife look what i found in the garden found loads of gold and then you work out how to keep it for yourself ha na eh you know how i'm maybe in the if i found treasure in my backyard i'm not going to shout it out to everybody cuz who are, people going to come along and start claiming oh what some of it is what well. what maharaj is saying is nay 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 meet together all my saints and share this wealth of naam because sikhi is all about sharing naam ne guru ne ji told us already they said to khavo kharcho ral mele bhai tot na aave vad ho jaye oh saints come together eat the naam khavo kharcho spend the naam this wealth of naam together ral mele bhai oh my brothers come together and then tot na aave it will not run out 
Why do we worry about that gold? Because we worry about it because it's going to run out. If you share it out, nothing left for you. Yeah? But this treasure of Naam can be shared and it never runs out. Totna Aven. And then, extra benefit, Vaddo Jai. It increases. The more you share it, the more it increases. And then why is Mara says Akat? Firstly, I told you we can't finish it because he's an oop. But also, sometimes you need to do give people an idea. Because why Guru is so undescribable, but still you have to give people an idea. Now why do we use things like iPhone analogy? Because people have seen the channel, they know I keep talking about the iPhone. Why do we talk about the iPhone to explain why Guru? Because we know about the iPhone. We understand this iPhone, yeah? So we use that to explain something like why Guru. You have to connect to him. You have to charge your battery up. You have to have a connection with some kind of service provider. Go through a Guru. And you have to daily, daily do good actions to get some credit on them. Then finally, when you make the call, Wahiguru, Wahiguru, you will connect. And you will realize you've got a hidden area of Dasan Dwar here, which can connect you to Wahiguru. Why do we do this? Because otherwise, people are not going to get about Wahiguru. Yeah? You have to give some kind of analogy. Same with the fitness analogy. The Guru doctor analogy. Guru Sahib gives a doctor analogy. There's no one here who's never been to a doctor. But Guru is our doctor as well. So, but also, why is it akat? Because the real reason is, is that the naam has to be experienced. You can talk all you like, but until we find the swad of connecting to Y group, kuch nahi hoya. It's just you heard nice talk and you go, chalo changaya, come back home. But it never made sense because we didn't connect to Y group. Just like somebody might listen to love songs, but don't really get it. When somebody's in love, every love song seems to make perfect sense. It's an emotion, it's an experience. So we are trying here to come to Gurdwara to experience the Naam. The, the Naam. And Guru Ra- Ram Das Ji is very clear. Jena har 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 ras naam na paaya, te paag heen jam paas. It's serious. Koi sokhi gal nahi. Those people that do not experience the Naam ras. Jena har 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 ras naam na paaya. What happens to those people that don't get the Naam ras? They don't experience the joy of saying Wai Guru's name. They don't experience the Dasan Dwar. What happens to them? They paag heen, jump pass. Then their destiny is to end up with Jamdut. They're not going to get Mukti. Because the only way to get Mukti, the only way to get liberation is through Naam. Bin Nawe, ko Muktana hui. No one can get Mukti without experiencing Wai Guru. Because we come here for experiencing Wai Guru, don't start saying, oh, it's so rude of Wai Guru. We've come here to experience Wai Guru. If we don't experience Wai Guru, then we have to come back again. We didn't achieve what we came here to do anyway. You can't go to a cinema, close your eyes, put uh, earplugs in, and then say, I saw the movie. No. You didn't see the movie. You're going to have to come back again and watch the movie anyway. See, Gana? There's nothing rude about it. We have come here to see the experience of Wai Guru. I see, Akhana dekhna hai, Kanala sunna hai ga. The naam. And you're going to taste the rasa of it. Jine kitta, come back again. Simple. So, Mara says, Akat ki kare kahani. Because we can't describe it, we have to experience it. And also, because this katha is the most important katha of all. Mara says, Sabte utam har ki katha, naam sunat, dard dukh latha. He said, The highest katha in this kaljug is about Wai Guru. Yeah? Sabte utam har ki katha. That talk. And then, if you, and why is it so important? Because it is naam. Naam sunat. Maharaj, they say katha sunat. They said naam sunat. Because talking about Wahiguru is naam. Many people, they have the same experience of naam when they listen to katha to when they're saying Wahiguru. Why? Because it is naam. Naam sunat dard dukh But the other meaning of that is also that the ultimate katha of Wahiguru is naam. When you're saying Waiguru, then you're actually doing Katha to Waiguru yourself. It's a personal Katha. As you experience it, because it's Akat, then the experience is the Katha of Waiguru. So you can take this both ways. Mara Khaizam. Kare kahani akat keri kit dwaare paai hai. They said, let's do talking about Waiguru, let's do Katha of Waiguru. But then, what's going to happen? When you start talking about somebody, huh, dekho, if I start coming over here and start talking about some famous person, you're going to come up to me afterwards and say, how do I meet that person? Sounds great. How do I meet him? Right? 
When you start talking about some amazing place, when you go to a news a, a travel agent, they start telling you about this amazing place to go on holiday. Next thing you'll ask is, how do I get there? How much it costs? You know? Same thing, Mara says, Ki, this Vaiguru is like a place, such kind. Vaiguru is like a person, a Kaal Puruk. When we start talking about Vaiguru in that place, So Dar Te Ra Keha, So Puruk, Mara says, Dan Katha, So Puruk, first So Dar and So Puruk, that place and then that person who's there, you to meet. Then what will we ask him? How do we meet him then? Milao, the So Ki Mimili. So Mara says, Ki, Kare Kahani Akat Keri, about Vaiguru. How do I find him now then? Dasso. How do I get him? Mara says, Tan man tan sab saump gur ko hukam manni hai paai hai They say, give your mind, your tan, your body, your man, your mind and your tan, your wealth, sab, all of them. Not just one of them. Dinna vajek chullo. Pick one out of three you're going to give away. No. Sab. Not just give half your wealth. Half your mind and half your body. Nay. Tan, man, tan, sab. All three things. Somp. Somp means to give. Gurko. Hukam, maniya. And then paiya. If you give your body, your mind, and your wealth to your guru, and then accept his hukam, then you will find why guru. Aitri kahila. The question we're going to say is ki why. If we ask the question why, that means at least we're thinking about it. The person who's not interested in giving their mind, body and so on, on it pushna bini. So said I'm not going to follow it. But nay, the question to ask is why should we give our body, our mind and all our wealth to our Guru? Well, some people will say why not just give it to God? Why give it to Guru? But what is Guru? Guru Rabbi Aya Api. Gur Par Brahm Parmesar Aap Guru is Par Brahm Parmesar Aap And then Aat Pahar Nanak Gur Jab Not Har Jab 24 hours a day Nanak would like to chant Guru Guru Wahe Guru Guru is that amazing that Guru is the light of God People think at daytime you have daylight and nighttime you have moonlight but it's not true At daytime you have daylight and at night time you have sunlight as well. So at day time you have sunlight and night time you get sunlight as well. It's just reflected from the moon. The moon doesn't have its own light. Moonlight is not a It is sunlight. It's reflected. So Guru Sahib is the moon. He reflects Guru. He is the light of Guru. And then the second thing is that the system is made by Guru. You might say, why do I have to give myself to Guru? Why not say to Vaheguru? Because Vaheguru sent Guru Nanak Dev Ji and they made this system. You can't get to Vaheguru except through a Guru. You might say, that's not fair. But this is the system that Vaheguru made. Just like you can't start the car, right, without pressing the start button, na? Ape ni hundi. Yeah? The same way you can't get to Vaheguru except through Satguru, through a Guru. And this time, Maharaj has told us that you have to go through your Guru. Tanu manatan sab somp gurku. And the proof of that, that you have to go through Guru, is in the Mool Mantra. Mool Mantra is given by Guru, Wahi Guru to Guru Devji. Okay, na? And what do we say at the end of that? Not at the end, but what do we say at the end of the Maha Mantra? We say, Gur Prasad. You have to go through a Guru's Kirpa. The system is made that way. You can't go straight to Wahi Guru. You've got to go through the Guru. Now, people say, why do I have to give my man tan and man tan? Isn't that a lot to ask? Huh? Firstly, where does it come from? Huh? This thing that we've asked to give to Guru Nanak Dev Ji, what is it, where does it come from? Man. Man has come from Vahe Guru anyway. Man tu jod sarup hai. Apna mool pachan. Or mine, you are Vahe Guru's light. So you're going to give Vahe Guru back to Vahe Guru. What's to give away there? Oda hi hai yeah. Then, tan, your body. Your human life is here. The human reason we've got the human body anyway is to meet Wai Guru. So by meeting Wai Guru, you're actually fulfilling the purpose of the human life. So how is that losing anything? You're gaining something. Suffer huh? Allah Rajivan. Then, tan, your wealth. Your wealth has come from Wai Guru in the first place. Mara says, Sukhni Sahib, Sok yo visre, jen sab kich diya. Why do you forget him who gave you everything? 
We say to our Guru all the time, Maharaj, Tusi Dita Ya. Tu Data Data, Tera Dita Khavna. He gives us everything. Dada Data Ek Hai, Sab Kush Oni Dita Ya. So what's it cost us to give back to him what he gave us in the first place? It's a loan, isn't it? We think it's ours, it's not ours. We just got to give it back to him. And really the question is, do we want to keep our mind, body and soul to ourselves? Tanaman ta rakhna apne kod. Can't keep it anyway. Tan you can't keep. When we die, it stays behind. Then they say, get rid of it. Your parvar now, say, oh I like this person. As soon as the soul leaves the body now, they just kick the body out. Nikal na, kaddo, kaddo bar. Take it to the funeral home. Get rid of it. No one wants to keep it in the house. Your wealth, they'll take it off you as well. Yeah, if you haven't left a will now, <laughs> bas gaya. Government will take some of it, rest will go with your family, bas chardi gala. Thanks so much for your wealth. Yeah? And then, all these things, the man will go as well. Nothing is left when the body is dead. So these things are temporarily ours, and they're a disease. The worst thing is, they're actually a disease upon us. They're all about hummi. The only reason we don't want to give them away is because of our homme. We have so much ego and attachment to these three things. But this homme is the disease. Homme diraga roga hai. It's the biggest disease we have. And the only way to get rid of that disease is to give it to Guru Sahib. Get rid of it. No one wants to keep a disease. We all want to get rid of the disease. Maharaj say, Minu Dedo Give it to me and I'll give you back the solution. No. I was thinking today, what example can we give? Kahani hai, na? What example can we give to explain this? Imagine you're going on a holiday, na? You book a really nice holiday with your family, yeah? It's going to be amazing. Let's think of some amazing holiday. It's going to be so much beautiful weather there. So many great things to do. You plan it with your family. Sare kush hoge. You go and tell your kids. You got a little kid in the house. And he goes, you tell the kid, we're going to go on a holiday to such and such place. We're going to do so many amazing things. And he goes, can I take my bike? We don't know, we can't take our bike because we're going to go on the plane. Koi fell on the bike though. There's other one to go then. And then you say, look man, it's going to be amazing. The Lord the bike the. You're going to enjoy yourself there. It's going to be loads of good things to do. He goes, no, 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 no. I'm not going without my bike. Now, this is a real example, isn't it? Because you can imagine this happening in families. Chote bache. Ajdi hondi hai gaya. Masa Sangat ji, idira hegana taan maan taan hai. This is the bike that we want to hold on to. We come here to Gurdwara, we matate to Guru Granth Sahib Ji, we listen to the Bani, we understand all these things. That is temporary. But Firbi, something holds us back from giving ourselves to our Guru. Something holds us back to, I want to keep this money for myself. I want but Jira Maharaj offer kare hai gaya? The thing that Maharaj is offering in return, this holiday to such khan, it's going to be amazing. Asi uthe jana hi hai ga na? Maharaj is giving us such an amazing thing to go to, but Firbi, when I said, no, I want to take my bike. No. Bike no maro goli. Give it away. Throw away the bike. Jump into Guru's lap. Yeah? We don't need these things. Maharaj is giving us naam. Taana maana taana. Sab saamp guru ko. Hukkama mani hai. Pai hai. Pai hai means you will get this. Maharaj is giving you such an amazing thing. Maharaj is giving all of us this promise. Ki if you give your mind, body and soul, to the Guru, Tana Mana Tana, Sab Somp Guru Ko, Hukam Maniye, Paiye. What will you get? The whole thing you came here to get in the first place. This is the reason our Jeevan will become Savariya Hoya. We've come to get this in the first place. We pull against the gate, we forgot we came here to get this. Hire Jaisa Janamaha, Kodi Badle Jai. Maya says this human life is so amazing. But for the sake of pennies now, it gets swapped. The holiday is so amazing, but the kid is prepared to get rid of it for the sake of that bicycle. And we, for the sake of our limited mind, our limited wealth, our limited amount of uh, body, we will give up the now. We'll give up all this. And Guru Dev has made it very clear to us. This is the way it has to be. Jo to prem kheran ka chao, sir tal tali, Gali meri ao, it marg pair tarije, sir dije kaan na kije. This is the only way we have to give ourselves to our Guru. Koi ho trika nahi hai. Mara says, Hukam manne ho Guru kera, gavo sachi bani. They say, oh Sikhs, 
listen to the Guru, Hukam of our Guru. And what is our Hukam? Sing Bani. They call it now Kaukam Ni. We think, what's it going to take? Mother saying, Sing Bani. Because in Bani, you will find the rest of Guru Sahib's Hukam. Na? When I find out what Guru Sahib's Hukam really is, Sing Bani, Sab Kuch Ute Likhya Hai. This reminds me of Jabji Sahib, really. This body, very much of Jabji Sahib, the very beginning of Jabji Sahib. We say to Maharaj, Give us a chiara hoya, give a kude to tepal. Maharaj says, Hukam Rajai Chalana, Nanak Likhya Nal. What's Likhya Hoya? Bani is Likhi Hoya. Bani Nathro, Nanak ne Bani Lik Diti. Nanak has written the Hukam down. Gunan Maharaj has written the Hukam down in Bani. So sing the Bani. They call Rabb is amazing, huh? Why Guru is amazing? But when Rabb speaks, when Why Guru speaks, he speaks in rag and in poetry. They flow. Didn't just give us some boring speech. It was an amazing speech, but he sang it and he wrote it in rag. We still doubt whether it's Akash Bani. But Maharaj, just look at the way they presented it to us. Amazing. So, Keva Satyara Hoye, the answer is the hukam. Whose hukam? Nanak Likhya Nal, the hukam of Gurbani. Because Guru is Bani. Bani is Guru. So the hukam of Gurbani. And if you understand the hukam, Nanak Hukme Je Buja, if you understand the hukam, then Homme Kahina Kwe. Our Homme will not speak. And what is the hukam? My Sauratana Mantan Sabsam Gurka. But what happens next in Japji Sahib? My says Gave Kotan. They started talking about Gavna singing. As soon as they told us, if you understand the hukam, they told us that start, some people start singing. So Gana hai, Gave Kotan. We sing about his praises, you know. So this is what Maharaj has told us in Japji Sahib. We must sing Bani and read Bani. And then at the end of that same party about Gave Kotan, Maharaj says, Kathna kathi na ave tot, kath kath kathi koti kot kot, avo sant pyaryo, a kath ki kare kahani katha do katha and do kirtan what happens in the gurdwara katha and kirtan and avo sant pyaryo sant pyare aage he got sangat and kirtan and katha that's happening in the gurdwara that's what this body is talking about and that's what our guru is telling us to do but the first thing we must do is come here and surrender ourselves to our guru tan man tan sab somp guru ko hukam manni hai we will get him if we please him by actually giving ourselves to him. So, this is the way to do it. So, Maharaj finished off this body. They go, Kehe nanak suno santo kathyo akath kahani. They say, Oh, nanak speaks now. Guru Dev Ji is speaking. We must all listen. Ki suno santo. Oh, my saints, listen. Kathyo, get together and speak. Do katha. Speak about. Akatha Kahani. The Akatha you will never be able to finish because it's a Katha of Vaiguru. So what we're going to do now is together to finish off this party, we're going to sing this party again. Okay? In Kirtan. Then we'll finish off the Katha. Most important thing for us to remember is it's all about Bani. We've come here to listen to Bani and to sing Bani.
So it's very important for all of us to take the message of this. Bani Gani. Yeah, make sure we get the time to sing Bani. Put the kirtan on. Take get rid of the other stuff in the in the car and put on the shabbat and sing out loud. Yeah, and get rid of the stuff that's playing on our phones, we're walking around. Put some kirtan on and sing Bani and let it affect us. We've come here to listen to Bani actually. Mara says in Hukum. Ki ayo sunan padan ko bani. Bani is naam. We've come here to listen to Bani and read Bani. And then if we don't do Bani, then Mara says naam visar lage analalach birtha janam parani. So if you forget naam, if you forget Bani, then what will happen to us? Naam visar lage analalach. We've got lalach for other things. We want that bike. We don't need the bike. Forget the bike, go on the holiday. Yeah? Naam visal lage analalach. And then, birtha janam pirani. We'll wait, we'll waste this human life which has been given to us for one purpose to uh, connect back to our Creator. Jiste upajiya nanaka soi pir hoa. Where we come from, let's go back there. Let's merge back with Him who we come from. So, kasa karde hoi. Kirtan kar de hoi, anek galti hoi hai gya, maaf kar de na. Forgive us the mistakes we've done in singing Kirtan and in reading Bani and in doing Katha. Bless all of us to carry on doing your seva, carry on explaining the Bani of Tan Gunan Dev Ji Maharaj, Tan Gunan Madhav Ji Maharaj. Deo Sajna Si Sariya, Jehova, Sahib Shio Meir, Pala Shukri Dikhyan Bhakshan Ji, Vahe Guru Ji Ka Khalsa, Vahe Guru Ji Ki Fateh.